My name is Alex Young. I'm here with Aqua Illumination. Showing off our brand new Hydra Prime. We're at Reefa Palooza, New York, 2016, and we're excited to uh, to show off some of our new products here. We're displaying our new Hydra 20, or excuse me, Hydra Prime over a uh, beautiful Red Sea Aquarium. This is a Red Sea 250. We've got a nice mixed reef here, and we're displaying our new Prime HD, like I mentioned earlier. The HD or Hyperdrive allows you to control your color channels above that 100% intensity mark. For example, if you run your whites, blues, and royal blues at 100% and have your other color channels like red and green at 50, you'll be able to utilize that extra 50% that you're not utilizing for each color channel for ones that you would like to use. Whites, blues, you could run those at 150, 200%. That's going to allow you to dial in more specifically the exact color spectrum you need for your livestock and allow you to make your corals freshwater plants, whatever you need, much more happy and uh, suit their needs specifically. Our previous Prime was a very great light, but we did not utilize that hyperdrive technology. So you get a much wider coverage area out of the Prime. It's gonna cover a 24 by 24 by 24 inch area, uh, as well as give you the ability to grow any type of coral from soft coral all the way up to SPS in a given area. Uh, we're very excited about this product. We just launched it last week. And, uh, and definitely go ahead and contact our customer service department if you have any more questions. We can be reached at 515-233-5105, extension two, or you can also email service at ecotechmarine.com. One question we're very commonly asked with the new hyperdrive functionality in our products is whether or not overdriving that color channel at over 100% is going to affect that specific diode's life or longevity. In no way will you be hurting those diodes by running them over 100%. They're absolutely made to be run at those levels, and, uh, and you will produce a slight more heat out of that specific color channel, but our fans run on a thermistor, allowing that heat to dissipate very quickly. So your light may be warm to the touch, but by no means will it be hot. It's always gonna stay cool, and with those LEDs, you're gonna be uh, getting a 50,000 hour life out of them. So uh, given, your average life, given your average usage on one of our lights, or any aquarium light for that matter, that's gonna put you in that five to eight year range, depending on how long you run your lights every single day. Another great thing about the Aqua Illumination brand and, uh, and the HD series as well, is if you go to our website, aquailumination.com, we have a side-by-side -side comparison with the Prime uh, against some of the other uh, more similar lights in the market. So you'll be able to get a co spectral comparison with both uh, par ratings and coverage area. So by doing that, you'll be able to make a better decision on which light is gonna be best for your reef tank. Uh, the, uh, the same goes for our 26 and our 52, our larger, uh, our larger lights there. So for a tank this size, two primes is gonna be all the light you can need for a, uh, for a Red Sea 250 with a nice mixed reef. If you did plan on keeping a little more, uh, little more SPS in there, need a lot of high light for some plans, you could go with two 26s, have a, have a very, very high par number and uh, be able to keep any corals that you'd like there. And again, if you go to aquailumination.com, you'd be able to do a side-by-side -side comparison with some of our other competitors in the market and uh, make the best decision for your reef aquarium. Once again, I'm Alex Young from Aqua Illumination. We thank you so much for coming out and visiting us at Reefapalooza 2016, and we look forward to seeing you guys next year.